I'm at the grave of Wendell Lewis Wilkie. He was born in 1892 and passed away in 1944, and he's buried here in the East Hill Cemetery in Rushville, uh, Indiana, which is Rush, Rush County. Uh, Wilkie was a U.S. presidential candidate, a Republican. Uh, he was an attorney, and uh, he served in the World War I, and upon his return home, he worked for Firestone Tire and Rubber Company in Akron, Ohio, before moving to New York. Uh, he made himself uh, uh, pretty well known, and he pretty outspoken against Franklin Roosevelt's uh, New Deal, uh, New Deal uh, during the Depression, and he got quite a bit of attention, uh, really leading him to be the presidential candidate for the 1940 election. Uh, Wilkie defeated uh, federal Republican, federal fellow Republican uh, Thomas Dewey. Uh, to, to secure the nomination, but he lost in a massive landslide to uh, President Roosevelt in the general election. He was ended up being appointed by Roosevelt to serve as an inter international diplomat. diplomat. In 1942, he uh, authored a book, One World, which he defined a post-World War II world of international peace and freedom. Uh, unfortunately, he would not live to see the end of World War II. Uh, he became ill and uh, had several heart attacks and, and, and died, and he ultimately suffered a, a fatal heart attack uh, while campaigning in 1944. So this is a very large cemetery, but it's well marked, easy to find. Uh, the Wilkie tombstone straight ahead here, we'll get close to it in a second, but uh, in front of it is a book opened up. I'm not familiar with the passage. I'll leave it here for a second. You can pause it if you'd like to read it. Very large cross, about 12 feet tall as the Wendell Wilkie tombstone. Have uh, Edith here, and then Wendell, Edith being his wife, died in 1978. And uh, Wendell Wilkie being buried uh, beside. As we move over we have Philip Phyllis Philip and Virginia Wilkie. Very nice monument here in a very very nice large cemetery. This is kind of the newer section as we go, newish section as we kind of go behind me here. Uh, much older section. It's beyond beyond this hill here. A very nice final resting place for a Wendell Wilkie, a Republican presidential candidate uh, that uh, lost to Franklin Roosevelt.